This is the Lockpicking Lawyer, and what I have for you today is a master lock that I hadn't heard of until a few weeks ago. I suspect that's because they were made for US government contracts, at least this has an NSN number, the one that hasn't been active in a while. It's the model 179LH Laminated Steel Combination Lock. Now, I tried to find a bit about it online and was amused to find this description. They say it provides high quality security for high value military property. They continue that the padlock is able to withstand extensive use, harsh environments, and defeat attempts to breach security. And finally, they say it's a combination lock with a bump resistant five pin tumbler cylinder. Pretty much every sentence reveals it was written by someone who knows nothing about locks. So how fast can we defeat this quote, high quality security for high value military property? Well, there are a couple of easy methods. The first one requires a notch decoder like the one that's part of the Covert Companion. I sell these over on covertinstruments.com. The combination is currently set to all zeros. So we're gonna mix them up. You can see it's currently locked. I'm going to slip the decoder between the lock body and a code wheel then press down on the shackle and lift up the locking bar. You can see we open that up, probably faster than we could have dialed the combination. Let's try that one more time. Once again, between the lock body and a code wheel, press down on the shackle, lift up the locking bar and it's open. Let's say, however, we don't have one of these notch decoders with us. There is another method. You can strike it on the face of the lock with a hammer and that can dislodge the locking bar. Let's give it a try. I'm going to press down on the shackle and then strike it right here. You can see that opened it up pretty quickly. Let's do that one more time so you can see it was not a fluke. Okay, folks, obviously this is a bit of a joke when it comes to security, and frankly, it should never be trusted with government property of any value. In any case, that's all I have for you today. If you do have any questions or comments about this, please put them below. If you like this video and would like to see more like it, please subscribe. And as always, have a nice day. Thank you.